YouTube. What's going on? Witty P coming back with another one. Let's get it. You know I got to keep the fire coming. Let's start the week off with some fire. Today I have a great one. Today I have a great one. Today we're going to talk about men must have a strong fallback game when dealing with women. Yes, men must have a strong fallback game when dealing with women. And let's be clear with what a fallback game is because a lot of men, they have a strong, you know, pull-up game. And what's a pull-up game is, you know, when you can come up on a female, give her compliments, you know, prop her up, you know, let her start feeling herself. You know what I'm saying? You, you giving her, you giving her the juice, you know what I'm saying? And she, she feeling, she feeling, she feeling untouchable. She feeling untouchable. So that's that's men's pull up game, you know. When you see a guy, you say, "Damn, shawty, you got it." You know, you got a nice body. This and that. That's that's a pull up game. But a lot of men, they don't have a fall back game. Yes, I have a strong fall back game. I pride myself in being able to fall back. You got to be able to fall back, and. I would always joke with my friends and say, I got a nice pull-up game with the females, but my fallback game is even stronger. Yeah, I would say my fallback game is even stronger. And what's your fallback game when you're dealing with women? Your fallback game is matching energy. Yes, I can match energy like none other. I can. Example. Let's say you you work with, you know, you got a coworker that you kind of flirt with every day. You know, y'all give her, y'all give each other hugs and shit like that. But she she come in, you know, two days in a row and don't even look your way, don't give you a hug, you know, no flirting, shit like that. Right? You don't go up and, and ask her. What's wrong? Everything all right? Everything cool? Fuck all that. You don't... Who cares what the fuck she got going on? You fall back. Yeah. You don't go up to her trying to give her a hug and shit like that. No. You don't. You walk right past her ass until she get her, until she get her act together. Until she get her mind right. Because you ain't do nothing to the chick. You ain't do nothing to the girl. So her acting weird and... and trying to play this leverage game with you don't fall for it don't don't see sometimes this could be a leverage game that they're playing or they might just not just be fucking with you like that you know but you as a guy you got to be able to fall back you got to be able to read the room read energy all of that shit to be like oh this how she this how she come in the day she act like she don't see it she act like she don't see it brother huh bet i don't see your ass either you got to be able to fall back Real talk. You got to be able to fall back. Chick thinks she got you right where you... She wants you. Nah, you got to be able to fall back. Because a lot of times they're trying to build leverage. Like, they'll try to play this game with you, be all nice with you, flirting with you, and then try to pull back and so you can chase them. Yes, so you can chase them. It's a, you know, motherfuckers be playing chess out here and shit like that. But you got to be able to fall back. I always tell my friends, my my fallback game is stronger than my, my, my pull-up game. Way stronger. Because I can read your energy quick. You acting weird, you on that bullshit, and I know I ain't do shit to you. But I ain't about to be running up to you saying, what's wrong, everything cool? I don't give a fuck. Fuck you. I, don't, I ain't do nothing to you. You acting weird on your own. Give a fuck what's wrong with you. If I know I didn't do shit to you. I'm going to match your energy. Okay, you ain't saying shit today? I ain't saying shit today. Fuck it. And I, and you, and in, in order to fall back, this is the key. You got to be willing to go your separate ways. That's the only way you can fall back from a motherfucker. You got to be willing to go your separate ways. If y'all don't ever talk again, you got to be cool with that. Or if y'all don't ever give each other a hug or whatever, you got to be cool with that. That's the only way you can have a real strong fallback game. Because you don't give a fuck if y'all ever talk again, hug again, any of that shit. You don't give a fuck. That's the only way you can have a strong fallback game. Real talk. You got to be willing to cut ties that day. Like, fuck it. I don't give a fuck. 
give a fuck about if you know you ain't do shit, you don't even want them in your life anyway. Motherfuckers just acting weird on you for no reason. And you ain't do shit, fuck them. You don't need them. But yeah. That's an example right there. You know, y'all give each other hugs every day. Then all of a sudden she walk past you or don't want to give you a hug or something. Or, or maybe she might be talking to somebody else at the job. Fuck, you start talking to somebody else. You got to match energy. That's all the fallback game is. You match energy. Period. You match energy. You got to be able to match a motherfucker's energy to know they not that important. Period. You got to be able to match a motherfucker's energy to show them you're not that important. And I can go my own way if I have to. You got to be able to fall back. I give you your space. I give you your space. That's what fall back do. You give somebody that space, like, do you. you. Do you. I don't give a f Do you. I'll fall back. Got to be able to fall back and match a motherfucker's energy. Men must have a strong fallback game when dealing with women. Real talk. Because if you don't, they... You'll be chasing guys and all that shit before you know it. They use a leverage tactics on you, all type of shit. Real talk. Got to be able to fall back. Or or a chick think, or a chick think you like her. You know, and she, every time you, you come around her or something, she kind of start moving or, or, or walking away or something like that. Go to the whole other side of the, of the building or the room, wherever you at, just to show her, I don't got to be in your presence. She think you like her. Fuck her. Go to a whole nother room, whatever. And don't say shit else to her. You got to match the energy. Oh, oh, you think I like you? I'm about to show you I, I, this. I ain't going to say I hate you, but I'm about to show you. I don't give a fuck about you. You go to another room, a whole nother area, let her know. And don't ever go back around her either just to let her know. To fuck with her hair, let her know. I never liked you. I don't know why you got that feeling anyway or idea anyway. That's how you got to do that. Like. I fucking think you like, oh, you think I like you, huh? I'm about to, okay, I'm about to show you. I'm about to go above and beyond to show your ass I don't like you. You're going to think I hate you, actually. You're going to go from thinking I like you to thinking I hate you. That quick. Because you won't, I won't even be around you no more. Real talk. But men must have a strong, you know, fallback game when dealing with women. Real talk. Well, let me know what y'all think. Drop some down in the comments. Keep the fire coming. Keep rolling. That's what I do. That's where you help share the video. If you're entertaining, hit that cash app. We're going to keep it rocking, keep it rolling. Knock another one out. Bah, bah, bah. Let's get it.